Welcome back to Game Odyssey. My name is Grayson, and today we're going to look at a brief history of the PlayStation 3. Sony officially unveiled the PlayStation 3 to the public on May 16, 2005 at E3 2005, along with a boomerang-shaped prototype design of the 6-axis controller. A functional version of the system was not present there. The initial prototype shown in May 2005 featured two HDMI ports, three Ethernet ports, and six USB ports. However, when the system was shown again a year later at E3 2006, they were reduced to one HDMI port, one Ethernet port, and four USB ports, presumably to cut costs. Two hardware configurations were also announced for the console, a 20 gigabyte model and a 60 gigabyte model released at the price of 499 US. 60 gigabyte model was the only configuration to feature an HDMI port, Wi-Fi internet, and flash card readers, and a chrome trim with a logo in silver. Both models were announced for a simultaneous worldwide release November 11, 2006 for Japan and November 17, 2006 for North America and Europe. At the Tokyo Game Show on September 22, 2006, Sony announced that it would include an HDMI port for the 20 gigabyte system. But a chrome trim, flash card readers, silver logo, and Wi-Fi would not be included. Also, the launch price of the Japanese 20 gigabyte model was reduced by over 20%, and the 60 gigabyte model was announced for an open pricing scheme in Japan. During the event, Sony showed off 27 playable PS3 games running on the final hardware. The PlayStation 3 was first released in Japan on November 11, 2006 at 7 p.m. According to MediaCrate, over 81,000 PS3 systems were sold within the first 24 hours of its introduction in Japan. Soon after its release in Japan, PS3 was released in North America on November 17, 2006. Reports of violence surrounded the release of the PS3. One customer was shot, campers were robbed at gunpoint, Customers were shot in a drive-by shooting with BB guns, and 60 campers fought over 10 systems. Following speculation that Sony was working on a slim model, Sony officially announced the PS3 Check 2000 model, also known as the PS3 Slim. It released on August 18, 2009 at the Sony Games Con Conference. New features included a slimmer form factor, decreased power consumption, and a quieter cooling system. It was released in major territories by September 2009. At the same time, a new logo was introduced for the console to replace the previous Spider-Man watermarks. The name, due to their use of the same font as the logo of Sony's then current Spider-Man films. With the new PS3 wordmark invoking the design of the PS2 wordmark, replacing the capitalized PlayStation 3 lettering. In September 2012, at the Tokyo Game Show, Sony announced a new, slimmer PS3 redesign, the Check 4000, also known as the PS3 Slim 2. It was due for a release in late 2012, and it would be available for either a 250GB hard drive or a 500GB hard drive. Three versions of the Super Slim model were revealed. One with the 500GB hard drive, and the second with a 250 gigabyte hard drive which is not available in PAL regions. Third is a 12 gigabyte flash storage that was available in PAL regions and in Canada. The storage of the 12 gigabyte models is upgraded with an official standalone 250 gigabyte hard drive. A vertical stand was also released for this model. If you like this history lesson today, make sure you smack that like button and please hit that subscribe button if you want to see more history videos like this. I'm Grayson from Game Odyssey and this has been a history of...